Hello. And welcome to a video that will help you uh, install the FTB Revelation mod, as well as join my public uh, Minecraft server. And maybe join my Discord. So why not? So, first, we're, if you don't have Twitch, the Twitch app, or FTB, you're going to go over to these. I'll have to put the links in the descriptions for these. You're going to go to the Twitch app. You're going to download the Windows or Mac OS. And once you're done downloading that, you can launch it, set where you want the uh, Twitch app to go. You can do the same thing for Feed the Beast. Go over to Feed, Be Feed the Beast. Go to the website. I will leave links for Feed the Beast and Twitch. Downloads the same. Not really much of a difference. So once you're done installing that, you're going to go to... Open up my Twitch. You're going to browse mods. You're going to type FTB. Oh, sorry. When you're going to be at your main thing, you're going to go here. You're going to go to mods. You're going to go to Minecraft. Browse mod packs. If you don't already have it installed, type in FTB. Scroll down a little bit. FTB Revelation. This is what the image looks like in case you want to look for that. You're going to click the install button for this. And once you're set with that, you're going to press play and that'll load your minecraft launcher now it's going to say a little ftb thing right there ftb revelation you're going to go to installations you're going to hit these three dots right here edit go to more options i'm going to reset mine so it looks exactly like yours you're going to change this to i changed mine to an eight the recommended the minimum for this mod pack is four so I have 32 gigs by RAM. I can dedicate eight. So if you only have eight gigs of RAM, four is your bare maximum. I would go honestly. So uh, let me grab FTB for a sec. We're gonna load the FTB launcher. Give it a sec. It probably doesn't like it that I'm doing multiple things at the same time. So we have our FTB launcher. Sometimes you'll find it in the featured section for uh, packs. You go to browse. It's featured FTB revelation. You probably just type it in the search bar if you want to. Uh, I'm trying to remember how to change the... Actually, no. I remember correctly. FTB revelation. Find my packs. Yep. Play. It's going to do the same thing installations three dots edit change that to 204 or an eight whatever amount you have so you basically you want it to look like that and you press save that's basically it so once your game's loaded it's going to take a bit to load like a, maybe a good two to three minutes if not longer depending on how much ram you give it so once you're done you'll be shown this screen this is the menu you go over to the side here to multiplayer. You click multiplayer. You click add server, name it. Emerald, oops. Actually, just name it whatever. And you're gonna put Emerald Absolute Phoenix dot games. My buddy is the one hosting this. His name is Absolute Phoenix. So the link is Emerald Absolute Phoenix dot games. I will also put this in the descriptions. So, once you join the server, it'll take a bit for you to load, depending on your computer specs and whatnot. Uh, feel free to go in your options, change whatever controls you want. We have uh, all sorts of mods on the server. Uh, so, by the time this goes up, we will have a spawn hub. Still working on that. So, this is going to be what you're spawning into. Well, roughly. Let's, put, let's say roughly for now. Because uh, there will be a building here. The middle of spawn is right here. That's your spawn point. So it might be changed by the time you join the server. So yeah. This is all protected, by the way. This is all spawn claimed area. I'm curious about something. Nah. But, uh, yeah. So, go to the description. Grab all the links you need. You got the FTB if you want to do FTB. You got the Twitch app if you're more comfortable with Twitch app. Uh, if you want to manage to put it in your own thing and 
screw FTB and Twitch. That's up to you. I will leave the links for the server IP for you guys, as well as my Discord's IP. If you want to join, I'm going to have the rules in my Discord and in the um, server itself inside the server spawn. Uh, the ser So read that. Server's going to be PvP based. We're going to figure out the rest later. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time.